Hello, good morning, good evening, whatever time of the day you come across my video. I'm Jana, the mother slash creator of Jay's Aesthetic Jewels, my small jewelry business. I look different today. No makeup and a t-shirt. Shout out to the JoJo merch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I made a video saying that my father ordered me a shipping label maker. And look what came in the mail. Bum, ba, da, da. My printed it. And I'm doing an unboxing video. With this video today, I will not do any cuts. If I have any bloopers, if I mess up, it's okay. Because it's authentic, I guess. And this is an unboxing, so I don't want to, you know start over and try to put everything back in if I mess up with what I'm saying. So, let's open it. Oh, and the stickers came in also. So, let me open this up. And this is the inside. You be careful. Do not drop it. Oh yeah, it came with some also. But my dad bought extra for me. I might need help. <laughs> need help? Maybe. <laughs> if I don't know how to read the instructions well. We'll read that later. I'm impatient. So this is probably the cord. And untangle that. So I'm guessing this goes to the printer and this probably goes to the computer. Put you right here. Oh, another one that probably goes into the wall. Unravel that also. Small. So now I know where to hook up the printer. Oh! Flash drive. Little baby one. Can't see. And there's one gigabyte worth of space on there, so that should be enough. It looks like a pocket knife, but it's fancy looking. It looks nice. Me, check that. Um, just the other side. Nothing special. Okay, time for the big reveal. Da 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 da. Ooh, fancy! And look, more cables and wires. And this box is now empty. Nothing in there. So I'm gonna pull the plastic back in here. Because I want to recycle these if I'm able to. So, three cords. Hmm. I hope I don't mix them all up with each other. Um, I see the box has this little part in, so I think this goes in here. No, wait. It has to. You know what? We'll figure it out. It's okay. And 
now to take the printer out. Ooh, it looks so fancy. Oh my God. Ooh, I feel like a professional. Oh, I see where the cords go. They go on this back side, and this is where the stickers print out. And peel that off. Time for a little ASMR size satisfaction. Peel, peeling, yeah. Fangirling over here. It feels like Christmas or my birthday or something. Look at that. It's shiny and you can see the reflection on here. Okay. And I see this orange switch oh, on both sides. So I think maybe that pops it open. Oh, wait. Gotta show you. Wrong way. No, do the noise. Okay, no, it's okay. Oh. What is this? Self test label range. So I'm guessing this is just to show. Uh, something I don't know, but let's put these cords in real quick. Um, but -da -dum -dum -dum. so I see this one. I'm gonna go this way. Oy. One and this cord goes here I think two um I think it's just two cords that goes in the printer itself and this probably connects to the computer and this connects to the wall mm. so this is probably incorrectly it just confused me for a moment um, now let's see how to put stickers in. Get out the way, please. Thank you. And I need a, a little smoothie break. Um, So this is how they look. That was not how I wanted it to go. Oh well. And I don't want to figure it out on my own first because I don't want to mess it up. Let's see. Oh, warning! The print head generates heat. Do not touch the print head or its components while or after printing has finished. It's a hot one then. Okay, so this just shows like what it comes in or what comes with it. So it's a printer, of course. All the cords, the stickers, user manual, and the USB stick or flash drive. So I got that, connected the cords together. <clears throat> Here's the tricky part. <laughs> Loading the labels. I feel like that's where it's gonna confuse me a little bit. So let's see. 
Ensure using direct thermal labels or the print will be blank. Verify the printing labels are properly loaded with the printing side facing up. So this is a printing side. Open the top cover by pressing both sides of the release button. This way. No, this way. Um, load the labels from the back. To ensure the paper runs flawlessly, type the printer... I can't read, sorry. <laughs> To ensure the paper runs flawlessly, type the printer guides against both sides of the label without leaving any space in between. So I guess it's this way. I mean, this should be easy because at my job, I load paper into like the uh, receipt printer thingy so this should be a breeze make sure it's nice and tight ah wait nope this probably needs to go all the way out first There. Close the top cover and turn the power on. The printer will start label recognition automatically. Um, I think I should plug this into the wall first. There's an outlet over here. Give me a moment. these to ride on okay we are doing something over here now the more tricky part or no this should be easy I'm not a tech savvy but it should be easy to set this up on my computer you know what I lied I will cut off to go to my computer and try setting it up real quick I'll be right back Okay, I'm at my desk now, and I'm about to plug this in to my computer. I'm hoping it can reach the outlet I have. I'm okay. We are okay. And I have stuff over here that I need to move out the way. Alright. And this will be plugged into the computer. So I'll put it here. do next 
turn on the label printer, install the driver software included in the USB stick, or go to this website to download the latest driver software. So with this, put that in. Sorry, I'm not showing what I'm doing down here. Or, you know what? Let me fix my angle. Give me one second. I'm still here, just down here. So, I'm gonna have these laying out flat. And I'm gonna have this facing this way so you can see a little better what I'm doing. And I'm honestly surprised I'm not struggling this much yet. So, happy facing that way. And get my handy dandy mouse and my little keyboard that I'm gonna keep in my lap. Okay. And let's see. Did you pop up yet? Sorry, I'm not showing my computer. I'm just showing this. Okay. What I'm about to say, where are my instructions? Right here. So, you turn on, insert the USB stick, go to Windows. You want to be slow today. How cute. Oh, I hit the wrong button on my computer. So I'm being slow. To I'm just kidding. I'm not being slow. I'm just trying to figure out what to do. That's all. Okay. And uh, it was V drive. Here we go. And double click and follow the prompt to complete the installation. Or can I do it this way? This is where it gets confusing for me. This is why I need help. <laughs> this is for Mac, so I don't need to read that. This is supposed to tell you how to install it on your computer. But I'm struggling a little bit over here. Maybe I need to go to the website real quick. So, labelranged.com. Okay. And here we go downloads. And download label range into is it Windows software? Cause I see a few options. I might have to show you this real quick. One second. This is my screen, so I don't know. <laughs> I don't know which one to click on because I'm thinking, do I download this one? Oh, wait. I didn't read all the way. LP320. Okay. Oh, okay. I see. Never mind. All right. 
So I'm downloading it, opening it up. Okay. Smoothie break. Mmm. There we go. Now we're getting somewhere. Now we're about to install it. That scared me. <laughs> Ooh, have mercy. Would you like to install this? Yes, I do. I surely do. Printer installed successfully. Okay. Now what? <laughs> okay. So to find the label printer <clears throat> after the installation is completed, go to start menu, settings, devices, da -da -da -da. So exit out, go to my files and see if I can find it. <laughs> okay. Let's see. <laughs> Come on, brain. I just got off work, so that's probably why I, I used my brain enough today. Uh, okay, to find the label printer after installation is complete, go to start menu. <clears throat> and then settings. My computer froze. Oh no. I'll be right back. Okay, so my computer is being stupid right now, but that's okay. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to print out a label from Etsy real quick and see if that works. Because I still have to print out the one from my father and put it on his package. And now my computer is frozen for realsies. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why? <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna restart my computer. I'll be right back. And we're back. I restarted my computer and I'm about to get on Etsy real quick. I will ship it out tomorrow, so Saturday. Mm. This is a package slash thick envelope. 
here's the package. Here's the measurements or dimensions. Ooh, and I have a scale to use so I can weigh it. Um, don't tell me you're broken. There we go. <laughs> I want to say, do not mess up on me today. Okay, 1.7 ounces. Not 107, 1.7. The length is... It's frustrating when they ask me what the width is because it's a padded envelope. There's no width. And okay, let's see. There we go. Move you out the way. And print the shipping label. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see if this will work. Oh, plug in the USB drive. <laughs> Forgot about that. you because this is confidential but uh, unless let me try again okay that is wrong oh um if I did it this way because I don't want to use these up Cause it looks like it's cut off. Oh my goodness. Okay. <clears throat> One more time. I might need to change the settings though. What is the size of this paper? Does it say? Okay, let's 
make sure I'm doing this correctly. There we go. Alright, this video was full of so many bloopers and mistakes, but it is okay. I got a printer, finally. Thank you again, Father, for getting this for me, and your package shall be on its way. So let's end this video. This is Jana with Jay's Aesthetic Jewels. These are my jewel babies, ready to be sold on my Etsy shop, which will be in the description box below, below, below. And I look forward to crafting for you. Thank you, and bye.